With this video, I'm going to completely debunk satellites in space, Google Earth, Google Maps being nothing more than smoke and mirrors, and obviously this fake, phony ball Earth that we're supposedly living on. Let's take a look here. Let's get a close-up of New York City, of any city street. Okay, look at this. You see cars, you see people walking on these on these city streets. Just look around. Everywhere you look, you can see every every bit of detail. Cars, crosswalks. Again, as I showed earlier, people walk in the streets. Okay? Now zoom out. Let's zoom out of New York. Now let's see if we can see any airplanes that are all the thousands upon thousands of airplanes. Now taking a look at Flight Radar 24, what do you see here? You see a, a helicopter. Now let's let's pan out here and take a look here at all these airplanes. This is real time Flight Radar 24. Now let's zoom out once again and just take a look at all these airplanes in the sky. Okay? I'm going to zoom out. Take a look at the whole entire United States. Look at, at how many planes you see in the sky. Again, this is all real time. It takes a little bit of time for this to all load up. And look at all that plane activity. Okay? Again, real time. Now, here's the problem. When we get back to New York City, where's all the planes in the sky? We should see them. So what I'm getting at is at a certain point, you're seeing real footage from an airplane. That's what Google uses. They have a fleet of airplanes that fly over all over the world and capture this footage. Okay? That it comes to a point when you zoom out is basically CGI. Again, not a single airplane anywhere. We should see planes flying over the Atlantic. We see nothing. You zoom in, you won't see anything. Again, it's nothing but CGI. Again, it's a mixture of real with fake. And that's how they do it. Okay, that very simple. The whole concept of, of Google Earth, Google Maps. Basically, again, a mixture of real when you zoom in. And there is an article online, which I will show, that shows that Google has a fleet of airplanes mapping the world. That's how they do it. It's that very simple. Let's once again look at Flight Radar 24 live. And what do you see? Look at all these planes. Okay, look at all these planes. Anybody can do this on their own. Again, it takes a little bit of time to load up. And you see none of these planes on Google Maps. So again, supposing Google has nothing more than basically <laughs> trickery on the way they basically put out their their information, their maps, real. Again, you could zoom in and see literally people walking the streets. There you see some people right here. Look, you see these two people walking this crosswalk. We can't see these enormous Boeing 747s, 777s anywhere in sight. Okay, where are they? Some boats. Okay. Much smaller than airplanes. Where's the airplanes? Show me an airplane, a single one. And this clearly demonstrates that there are no satellites in space. You know, this is all done, conducted by, by airplanes that fly over the plane. That's why they're called airplanes. They're flying over a plane. And again, when you look at so-called satellite images, all you see are these cartoons, basically composites, nothing real. Okay, you think this is real? Give me a break. All fake, garbage, nonsense. And once again... These so-called satellites exposed, Google exposed as nothing more than smoke and mirrors. And as I mentioned earlier from this one article, 
Google has its own fleet of airplanes to map the world in 3D. So there you go. Very simple. Easily debunked when it comes to so-called satellites in deep space. You know, we live in this world full of deception. Few can get past it. And again, I said it so many times, ego is the biggest enemy of truth. With all the videos I'm making covering the flat earth lately, I'm getting a lot of questions about satellites. You know, this is their evidence that the earth is a ball. But let's take a look at these images of these satellites. Do these look real to you? I want you people that talk about satellites all the time to show me a real image of a satellite. All you get are these CGI images. Not a single real image of a satellite anywhere. Why is that? All we get is this fake garbage. You get a CGI satellite. You get a CGI planet. All bogus. 100%. So, for all you people coming to my channel, talking about satellites, make a video, produce real satellites. You can't do it because they don't exist. Period. Supposedly close to 3,000 satellites up in space. Again, all we get is this fake garbage. Now let's look at what ISS has to produce as far as real satellites. Get that fake garbage. You get this. All CGI, computer animated. It looks like a video game. Where are the satellites? You don't see any because they don't exist. Look at this. Wow. You believe this is real? If you believe this is real, you're going to believe every single lie NASA, the media, your government tells you. You've been completely blinded from birth. You believe everything you've been told your whole life. And any time someone questions an official story by your leaders, you get angry, you get upset, you get defensive. Because no one likes to be told they've been lied to their entire lives. But all you get, again, is computer animated garbage. Your whole life is nothing but garbage. Now with the supposed live feed from the ISS, you get this bogus CGI satellite here. You believe this is real? You gotta be kidding me. Complete mockery on the masses that take lies as truth and truth as lies. John, chapter 9, verse 25. Whereas once I was blind, now I can see. Now I can see. Now I can see.